All right. Shalom. This is uh, Brother Yawanathan, the bottom of the wall. I'm coming at you with another lesson through the Spirit and Power Yahweh Shemel Shah. First and foremost, as always, I want to start by giving all praises and glorifications to Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shah, Bahasham, Rakakodash, double honors to the apostles and elders that great minister on well. Peace, love, and salutations to the hopeful elect throughout the four corners of the earth, preaching his word in truth and in sincerity. Shalom. Okay, um, the title of this lesson is IUIC, this is your God. Okay, IUIC, this is your God. Because they come in the name of this uh, so called God right here. Okay, uh, so called Jesus Christ, aka Serapis Christus. Okay, so the IUIC, by you teaching hell, teaching that hell, that BS hell doctrine, you come in the spirit of Christianity, man, so called Christianity. Okay, because you're you're no different, man, than a Christian church. You might as well uh, uh, not even profess to be Israelites, man. Okay, and just just uh, 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 go in whatever denomination of Christianity there is, man. Because you're not coming in the names of Yahweh Shem El Shai. You're not um, really rooted. You're not um, new creatures. Okay, you're you're um you're coming in the vibration. Uh, uh, of this uh, 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 God forsaken religion So to speak man Which is uh, Has destroyed our people Alright For, for uh, centuries Alright And generations man Okay Cause hey, like, uh, Another reason why You're no different Is because you're on a 501c3 charter Okay And these These pastors Okay They're on a 501c3 charters Okay Which uh, means ta Tax exemptions Okay, so um, your leader Nate, man, he's he's the uh, the the head of that man. All right, your leader, he's on the five hundred one c three charter, as uh, well as all your organizations, man. Okay, um, his uh, his other leader, the other leaders, of IUIC, they are the five hundred one c three charters. Okay, so that's no different from um the Christian church, like I said, with these these pork chop being pastors, man. Okay. Like I said, you come in the name of Jesus Christ, okay? Yeah, y'all uh, teach the law, but y'all might as well not teach the law because you don't keep the law, okay? You're, you're a bunch of hypocrites, and Christianity, that's a hypocritical religion, man. You got nothing but a bunch of hypocrites in Christianity, and that's what uh, you guys are, man, and now you I see, man, okay? And, and now you're teaching the hell doctrine, okay? You're teaching the hell doctrine. Which that's totally off, man. Which we have been, um, you know, rebuking that for years, man. Okay, we've been rebuking that for years, and I don't, I don't know how much Esau <laughs> paid Nate off this time to teach that BS, but it had to be it had to be a great deal of money, man, because Esau had to come with with a, with a large sum to bribe Nate, man, to teach this madness, man, teach hell. Okay, but um, there's a scripture I want to start off with. Do the spirit and power of y'all by Shemel Shah. Okay. Because y'all y'all further keeping our people in slavery, man. Alright, with this this madness, man. You're not you're not really uh uh renewed creatures. Okay? So this is uh second Corinthians eleven and four. It says, For if he that cometh preaches with another Yahweh Shah, it says Jesus right here, but they all come in the name of Jesus or Jesus Christ, right? It says, Whom we have not preached right we don't teach this guy right here man okay we don't we don't teach this 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 faggot right here man okay we teach this guy more show my um right here you see so-called black man y'all y'all know that the lord is so-called black man and he has a hebrew name his name is yahweh shah not no jesus but here it is y'all have hebrew names okay so like y'all have Hebrew names, but the Lord can't have his uh holy Hebrew name. All right. And y'all some clowns, man. It says, for if he that come and preach of another Yahweh Shai, okay, or another savior, because that's what it means, uh he the uh uh he delivers or he saves, right? It says, Whom we have not preached. Remember, we don't preach that guy, we don't preach Jesus Christ. We preach you how about Shemel Shah, man? Okay? The sound doctrine. 
Okay, it says, or if ye receive another spirit, and y'all come in another spirit, man. Y'all not coming in the spirit of Yahweh Hashem, y'all. Y'all come in the spirit of Satan. Okay, it says, which we shall like, which ye have not received, or another gospel. Okay, because these Christians, they like to call it the gospel. What they preach, they're 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 off doctrines. They say that's the gospel. That's not the gospel. Or good news. That's what the uh, word gospel means. It means good news. And what's good, what's good news about you know having your oppressors rule over you? All right. Uh, um, being on the vibration of Jesus Christ. Okay. Want to want to uh, prosper in this society? That's not good news. We're in slavery. We're in captivity, man. Okay. So that's another that's another gospel. That's another spirit, man. Teaching hell. Okay. So if hell was a uh, hypothetically, if that doctrine was real, um, our power wouldn't be merciful, man. You might as well have a, a Edomite, a Edomite God. It might as well be an Edomite God, which Jesus Christ is pretty much an Edomite God, man. All right. That's not merciful, man. Going um, to a realm and burn forever, which spirits don't burn any damn way. <laughs> okay. So it reads on, which ye have not accepted. But let me read this part again. It says, if ye receive another spirit which ye have not received, or another gospel, which ye have not accepted, ye might well bear with him. Right? So, the Lord has blinded you, and you're going to stay in that uh, madness, man, if he doesn't snap you out of it, man. Okay? You're going to continue to teach Jesus Christ. Okay? You're going to continue to uh, come under the vibration of Satan. Why? Because you paid off. Okay? Let me get a scripture on that. Let's go to Titus. Let's go to the, uh, I think Titus 1, feel, okay, let's see, I'm typing in, bear with me, brothers, uh, filth, filthy lucre, let's see, matter of fact, let's lock. I'm gonna go straight to it. Well, matter of fact, okay, here we go. Um, all right, let me, um, start at verse this is titus 1 and um start at uh verse 7 it says for a bishop must be blameless as the steward of the most high right and nate you, uh, you call yourself a bishop right hey the lord says you got to be blameless and you're not blameless man because you you teaching off doctrines you have your congregation go off and teach off doctrines first of all you say the name don't matter okay um you don't believe the motb salaki satan man all right, you don't believe the MOTB is the uh, the microchip, right? And now you're teaching hell, amongst other things you go off on, man. You got guys in, in your camp with dreads and lineups, but you say keep the law, <laughs> okay? You come in the uh, vibration of Christianity, like the brother uh, uh, the, um, Montreal, he did a video concerning y'all. All right, he, he entitled the video, uh, Israelite United in Christianity, because Hey, y'all might as well unite with uh, so-called Christians because you come in the same mindset, the same BS mindset of those those peons, man. OK, so it says again, for a bishop must be blameless as the steward, meaning a servant of the most high, not self-willed. And, and Nate, you're you're very self-willed, man. OK, you, you, you all it's it's really all about you and glorifying you in vain glory. It ain't and, and, and most importantly, it's not. Uh, 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 about exalting Yahweh by Shemel Shah, man. Okay? It says, not soon angry, not given to wine, nor striker. Not, the point, not given to filthy lucre. Right? Getting paid off by Esau to teach madness, to teach hell. Okay? Which we know uh, the hell doctrine is a bunch of B, uh, uh, BS, man. Bullshit. To say it frankly. Okay? It says, verse 8, it says, but a lover of hospitality, a lover of good men, sober, just, holy, temperate, 
holding fast the faithful word, see, as he have been taught that he might, it's like that he may be able by sound doctrine, and that doesn't include teach hell, teaching hell, all right, is not sound uh, doctrine. Teaching the MOTB is a, a credit card, debit card, and some other madness is not sound doctrine. Teaching the name that uh, doesn't matter is not sound doctrine, right? It says again that he may be able by sound doctrine both to exhort and to conv convince the gainsayers, right? It says for they, there are many unruly and vain talkers and deceivers, and IUIC is one of them, one of the camps that that's, uh, uh, fits this, right? Again, it says for there are many unruly and vain talkers and deceivers, sp uh, specifically day of the cir circumcision, meaning what? Those that know that they Israel, but they come in another spirit. Okay, they come in another vibration. They they still in that that worldly vibration, man, because they ain't put off the old man. They ain't become a new creature. They still want to have their foot in the world and, and, and foot in the truth at the same time, man. It doesn't work like that, as we say time and time again. All right, the scriptures say you cannot serve uh, uh, God and Mammon in uh, the book of Matthew the sixth chapter, which God and Mammon represents. The God of uh, uh, riches or wealth, okay, and that's what uh, uh, guys like Nate want, man. He wants the riches of this world, the filthy lucre of this world, man. All right, so that's why they sell out, okay, and, and teach these these uh, off BS doctrines, okay. It says, hey, verse eleven, it says, whose mouths must be stopped, and we're stopping, uh, you false prophets, uh, mouths through the spirit and power, Yahweh Shemal Shah. It says, who subvert who subvert whole houses teaching things which they ought not see for filthy lucre's sake see that for, again for filthy lucre's sake so you're teaching things which ought not to be taught like hell man the latest uh uh, uh, uh fallacy of iuic teaching hell okay for filthy lucre's sake like i said i don't know how much he saw them paid you off all right, to teach that madness, but it had to be, it had to be a, a great a sum of money, man, for you to have your congregation go off and teach that madness, man. Okay. Let me see. That's pretty much it on that, man. All right, so let's go back to this image, man. It's this is what this is your God, IUIC again. This is your God right here, so-called white Jesus. You coming in another spirit. You're coming in another, uh, you're teaching another, uh, uh, uh shot, so to speak, man. Another savior. Okay. It was up to y'all, man. We'll, we'll still be in captivity. Okay. We'll still be under this, uh, so-called white man's, f uh, foot, man. Okay. And you other camps too, man. They don't exalt the names Yahweh by Shemel Shah. All right. So I'm going to basically end it on this scripture, man. It's lucky. Let's go to, uh, What's that? Uh, Proverbs 30. 30 and 4. I'm going to end it off on this. This is Proverbs 30 and 4. It says, Who hath ascended up into heaven or descended? Who have gathered the winds in his fists? Who have bound the waters in a garment? Who have established all the ends of the earth? What is his name and what is his son's name? If thou canst tell. All right, and they, you know the names, man, but you refuse, you refuse to teach, you refuse to teach those names, man. All right, so you're going to be held, at least you repent, you're going to be held accountable, man. The, the Lord's going to uh, uh, hold you accountable to that, man. You're going to, you're going to uh, suffer a, a brutal judgment, man. Okay, at least you repent, man. Okay, but the spirit, the oil has been taken away from you, and that's why you're going off heavy. Teaching hell, teaching the vibration of Christianity, man. Which, basically, you, y'all might as well, like I said, you might as well be a Christian, um, denomin another Christian denomination that just says you're Israelites. You might as well join Geno Jennings, man, because he know he's an Israelite, but he he totally goes off. He says Esau can be saved, the other nations can be saved. Next thing you know, y'all gonna be teaching that, okay? Because I remember at one point, y'all, uh, uh, you. You uh, order your congregation not to teach against Esau, so that's not that's not uh, far fetched, man. Okay, 
But anyways, I'm going to um, end it off on that. I just want to bring that out, man. Like I said, man, hey, this is your God, man. This is IUIC's God right here. Right here, Cesare Bozier, man. Okay, a.k.a. White Jesus. All right, so um, I'm going to end it off on that. Like I said, Lord willing, this was edifying. I'm going to sign off again by saying all praises and glorifications. Goes to Yahweh, by Shema, by Shema, by Shema, by Shema, by Double honors to the apostles and elders that great minister and well. Peace, love, and salutations to the hopeful elect throughout the four corners of the earth, preaching his word and truth and in sincerity. I'm going to say, Shalom, call me Ashala, and the Bible ball. Shalom.